Now, high-stakes standoff is unfolding on the Russia-Ukraine border as well, with both sides escalating their military actions. As Ukrainian forces press deeper into Russian territory, Moscow vows a punishing response to the unprecedented incursion. Take a look. President Volodymyr Zelensky, breaking days of silence, finally acknowledged the offensive, declaring that Kiev is pushing the war into the aggressor's territory. This bold statement marks a significant shift in Ukraine's strategy, moving from a defensive posture to a more aggressive stance. Russian Defense Ministry released these images showing a destroyed Ukrainian command post and dozens of military vehicles in Kursk. Moscow also claims more than 1,100 Ukrainian troops in the fierce fighting inside the Russian territory. This Ukrainian lightning-fast maneuver has not only exposed vulnerabilities in Russia's defences, but has also forced the Kremlin to divert precious resources to shore up its borders. Russia says Ukrainian missile attack in Kursk has injured several civilians. Moscow has responded with a barrage of missile strikes on Ukrainian cities, including a recent attack near Kiev, which reportedly killed civilians. Kremlin has also imposed a state of heightened alert in border regions and deployed additional troops to the area. Belarus, a close ally of Russia, has joined the fray, accusing Ukraine of airspace violations and massing troops on its borders. Russia has evacuated tens of thousands of civilians from the Kursk region and Ukraine has also evacuated thousands of people from the Sumy region across the border in signs that fighting is only going to get intense in the coming days. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.